Keep me posted. We get it. Your boardroom wants regular updates across all industrial operations. You'd settle for knowing what OT assets are connected, and maybe no zero days? But racing for digital transformation while securing OT has made things tricky. <laughs> Connected OT assets can help lower costs and boost productivity, but they can also increase your vulnerability to unexpected threats. That's where Zero Trust OT Security from Palo Alto Networks comes in. Powered by AI, it's the most comprehensive solution for all OT environments, helping you protect assets, networks, and remote operations. Take this manufacturing facility. If a cyber attack were to disrupt operations, it can be costly, compromise the supply chain, and diminish the brand. Built on a proven zero-trust approach, this OT security solution protects production, reducing complexity and increasing resilience, so you can minimize downtime. It's a powerful platform, specifically designed to harmonize IT and OT. <clears throat> this is key when you have strict compliance requirements that come with regulated industries, like utilities. Power is the linchpin connecting critical infrastructure. And when there's an outage, yeah, it directly impacts health and safety. Failure is not an option. Zero trust is ideal when there's zero tolerance for something going wrong. It ensures security policy enforcement and granular access control across OT and IT networks. Having that control is vital, especially when you're in a high profile industry, like energy. With a unified platform, energy operations get real-time visibility across widely distributed and remote assets. Visibility helps enhance threat detection, allowing teams to anticipate and prevent future attacks. No matter what industry you're in, one thing remains constant. Predicting what's coming and securing what matters most, from people to production lines. Gain confidence over the unknown while increasing resilience, visibility, and control with Zero Trust OT security from Palo Alto Networks. <laughs>